hey you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl jasmine and in today's video i'm going to be reviewing the new pattern beauty hair care line by tracy ellis ross i've been waiting 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 to try this shampoo i've had it forever but just haven't gotten a chance to try it and i thought what a better way to try it than on camera for you guys so that you guys can know how it feels know whether to spend your money on it or not you know what i mean know the whole deal so here we go let's just hop right into it it's wash day y'all so we already know the hair was looking crusty but we're about to get it together okay we are rinsing our hair making sure that it's nice and soaking wet so that when we go ahead in with that shampoo it will be ready for it um, for the shampoo, I'm going to be using the Hydration Shampoo. Um, this retails for $20, and there is only the one specific kind of shampoo. Um, there are three different kinds of conditioners, but I'll get to those later. But just the one shampoo. This is specifically for curly-headed chicas. So don't be afraid to get up in there. It felt cleansing, clarifying, but without stripping my hair. If you know what I mean, if you've tried other um, shampoos in the past. So then we went ahead and rinsed the hair. Um, yeah, the shampoo felt really good. It was not stripping and it smelled really good. It smelled like tea tree oil. And now I'm gonna go ahead in with the conditioner. Now the conditioner I got, um, first of all, I wanna comment on, I love how they have the conditioners bigger than the shampoos. I feel like that is perfect. If y'all have curly hair, y'all know the struggle of having less sh conditioner than you do shampoo. So I am going in with the conditioner for the curlies. Um, they do have a chart on their website that show the different type of curls that they cater to, tight textures, coilies and curlies and I put myself in the curly category so I went ahead for that shampoo that conditioner not shampoo and um yeah I love it it felt super hydrating and now I'm just detangling my hair in the shower so that I don't have to do it after the fact and just one more time for that conditioner y'all can never have too much like I said curly girls know to struggle you can never have too much conditioner so now I'm just gonna go ahead and put that into a bun I'm gonna wait 10 minutes and I'll be right back Hey, what's up? I'm back, y'all. <laughs> 10 minutes later. And now we're about to go ahead and rinse this out and listen. Listen, my hair felt amazing. It felt so silky and soft. I was stunned. Y'all see my face? I was stunned at how silky it felt. It felt so smooth. And again, it has that same great smell as the shampoo. I think it's tea tree. I should have looked into it before I started talking about this. But yeah, I think it's like a tea tree oil that is in it which is very good for stimulating like hair growth and the smell is just so calming and relaxing to me. So after we get out of the shower, we're going to go ahead and take our hair out of the towel. It's still pretty damp. And y'all, this smell, it smells so good. Like I can't get over it. If you don't like tea tree oil, you might not like it, but I love it. So I'm going in with the leave-in conditioner. Um, I put a very, very, very generous amount on just because like I said, I feel like my hair can never get enough hydration. Um, this retails for $25. Um, it is about the same size as the shampoo bottle. So uh, not as big as the conditioner bottle, but a little smaller. I feel like it's a good amount though. And I'm just gonna be applying a little bit more. I feel like my curls look so good already without even putting any product in. Like when I first took them out the towel, I felt like my curls look so defined. And this is just making them look even more defined. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wait 30 minutes for this to dry. And um, yeah, I guess we're gonna come back and see how this looks. Yes, so after the 30 minutes, my curls already look bomb. Like they look so defined and so healthy already. Just wait till y'all see how it looks when they're fully dried, okay? This is halfway through, just wait on it. All right guys, so this is me with my hair fully dried. I just filmed a video, so I've kind of been playing with it a little bit. So it definitely got a little bit more frizzy than it was in the beginning. Um, but for the most part, this is essentially what it looked like when it's fully dried. Okay, listen. Love the shampoo. Love the conditioner. Loved the um, leave-in conditioner. But 
I still feel like my hair's a little dry. Now listen, I like my curls to look glossy in a sense. Like I don't want it to look dull and I don't really feel like I see shine in my hair. Granted, they do have an oil in the um, pattern line as well. Uh, but I just didn't get it because I was like, dang, I'm already spending like $60 on these um, shampoo and conditioner and all that stuff. So I was like, the oil, I got oils at home. So I feel like with the oil, this would have snapped. But besides my hair being not glossy and looking a little dry, y'all, my curls look great. Like, I don't know if you can see, but each of my curls is so defined. And I just feel like my hair looks and smells and feels so healthy. Besides the shine factor, I feel like it's like I love this these products. She does say that you could put this over dry hair and um, that it would like help tame flyaways, but I feel like it wouldn't really give me a shine still, but I feel like it maybe would take away some of the frizz, but I'm looking for that shine factor. I like my curls to be shiny. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some oil real quick and we gonna see like what happens when you put some oil on it. Okay, so this is my Argan Oil, um, the Moroccan Beauty Secret Light Dry Oil Hair Mist. I got this from TJ Maxx. So I'm just gonna put this on my hands. Now listen, um, my hair, I don't wanna get you, get it twisted. Like my hair feels moisturized but it just doesn't have that shine that I feel like makes it look moisturized but the curls don't feel crunchy they don't feel dry like none of that stuff I just feel like I just want that shine I want you to be able to see the light gleaming off of my curls I don't know about y'all but that's that's it for me okay so can never have too much oil not in the Corley Gore's head not at all, boys, not at all. Okay, so now that I went ahead and applied some oil in my hair, I feel like that looks 10 times better. Like, I just feel like that oil set it off. So listen, maybe if y'all are gonna try the pattern products, definitely either have your own oil at home, like me, or try the, um, I think it's like an argan oil. I think it's listed on the back of here. Oh, it's Pattern Tahoba Oil Serum. That's the oil that they have. So maybe y'all should try that. I'm sorry I couldn't try that for y'all as well, but your girl only got so much fun. So I've had oil, you know, you just feel me. I had oil, okay? So yeah, final thoughts on these pattern products is that I love them and I'm all about what they're about. Like, I love the fact that Tracy Ellis Ross is a fellow curly haired lady. Like, you know what I mean? So she knows what curly headed women need. Like she not gonna give us nothing. Like we're not trying to get no curly stuff created by, you know, people who don't have curly hair, we got straight hair. How's that, how's that work? No, we want our curly hair products to be catered to us specifically. So what better way to be catered to us than by somebody who is a curly girl as well. So love that. And I also love the packaging of the products. I just think they're so cute. Like how they have like the half faces on it with the curly, curly little hair and then each of them are different. And I especially love how they have different conditioners for different types of curly hair. They didn't just lump us all together and say, oh, curly hair is curly hair. No, because my curly hair is way different, maybe way different than yours, maybe way different than hers or his. You know what I mean? We all have different types of um, curly hair patterns and hair textures and I feel like what she's doing with this is so important and it definitely is like a movement like you know what I mean like you know how people are always mad that there's not like inclusivity in different shade ranges because everybody's not the same shade of brown everybody doesn't have the same type of curly hair either so Tracy Ellis Ross you doing it and I I, I appreciate you. I just love how it makes just, my hair is just big. It usually takes me like maybe like two days for my hair to be like this poofy because I like when my curls are like big and out and I feel like that gave it to me without weighing my hair down. You know what I mean? Like my curls just look like it's just framing my face so much better. All right, y'all, so that's gonna conclude my video for today. I hope that you liked it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I would love to hear your thoughts on this video, so if you wanna leave some comments down below, you're more than welcome to. If you've made it this far on the video, I ask that you please, 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 please hit the link in the description box below and leave a testimonial for me so that I can be a part of Sephora's new squad, Squad Sephora, you know. I can be a part of that influencer program that they have. All you have to do is say a few nice words and why you think I should be chosen to be a part of their squad. If you want a little bit more information, go ahead and click that link below and it'll give you a little bit more details and it'll tell you why your testimonial is so important for helping me get selected. I hope you guys know I love you so much and I will see you in the next video. We'll pop some right here. I got other hair videos, makeup, lots of stuff. <laughs>
you guys want to see, go ahead and click. It's not going to be a problem. Just 